So I'm going to get ready and we're going to do a little bit of story time. Today I go and they're going to do bloods on me and then also check the lining of my uterus. Nothing really important, but I still have to drive to Nashville, which is fine. I love Nashville, so it's not a big deal. I hope I'm not late today. I just don't have the patience for being late. I'm usually like an hour early, so... I think we're gonna be okay. More coffee. Okay, while well, that's doing that, let's go curl my hair. I shut my eyes, trying not to speak, pretend that I'm dreaming. I smell your breath, not listening, but I still hear you screaming. Step away till you hear what I'm saying Sounds like thunder And the clouds are closing in You see, I know this But the last days in real life I've noticed Losing focus Breaking up from our life as we know it It's today The sweater's from Pink Lily Very festive Jeans, Express Teddy bear jacket from Nordstrom And... Let's go to Nashville. What do you say? I drove all the way here to get labs drawn and that's it. So I'll get a voicemail later today telling me, um, I guess what meds to start on tonight. Good thing I have plenty of other things to do today because I'd be pissed to drive down here <laughs> just to get labs drawn. But it's part of the, part of the pain. Okay, I've made it to Best Buy and I've obviously ran my Starbucks already. Okay, first things first, let me bring you up to speed. I'm gonna be without my camera for two whole weeks, so I'm not gonna get it until probably after Christmas, which is a real bummer. So I hope you guys don't mind me vlogging on my phone because that's just the way that the cookie's gonna crumble. Second, I uh, asked you guys on Instagram to vote yes or no. Do you think I should go to Opry Mills today? Pretty much everybody said yes. And so I am here at Opry Mills. I can't believe I'm here. This is like retail hell, but they do have good deals and do it for the vlog, right? Do it for the vlog. So here we go. Let's go in Opry Mills and see what we can find. Don't think I was even in there for 30 minutes and I already did some damage, but since I was towards the front of the mall, I'm gonna go ahead and do a car haul and show you what I got and change shoes because these, here I'll show you. These boots were not made for walking, okay? No, and I'm gonna be walking a lot so I'm gonna change into some of my new shoes. Okay, <laughs> this is a little awkward but we're gonna do it. All right, so the first shoes that I got, I asked you on Instagram if I should BOGO I didn't really wait on your answer. <laughs> I feel like that that goes without saying. Of course you should both go with shoes because I don't have enough shoes, right? So I got these Adidas. They're called the um, QT Racer. I've been seeing these online a lot. I don't know why I wanted a pair <laughs> so badly. I just feel like they're gonna look extremely good with leggings and we're going to be doing a lot of traveling here in the next few months and I need some good travel shoes so I got these they were these were the ones that got I got on 50% off so these were like $30 and then oh god then I got this. <laughs> these are called Linden Woods 
uh, and they're ladies Timberlands. So, show you what they look like. These are the ones I'm gonna put on. This is what they look like. I just thought that they were really nice. I've never had a pair of Timberlands, and you know, hey, BOGO, baby. Might as well go for it. Okay, new boots, new me, and uh, headed back in. Cheers. actually was not crowded hardly at all today so if you're planning on going to Opry Mills I recommend going on a Monday from 11 to 2 because I didn't have to stand in line anywhere nothing was crowded I didn't have to wait to sit at the bar at a restaurant to eat like this is probably the best time I've ever been to Opry Mills and there was no one waiting in line for Santa so yeah I'm going home but I'm probably gonna probably gonna make another stop at Starbucks to be honest so yeah when I get home I'll show you everything that I got just got called from my fertility clinic all my labs looked good so I have to start injections in the morning why is that so bright oh my gosh <laughs> okay so yeah start my Lupron in the morning which is a sub-Q injection and then I go back on the 18th <laughs> Okay guys, we're gonna go through what I got at the mall first and then I'm gonna show you what I got in the mail. Not all of this is for me, so I can't show you everything. So I went to Best Buy, as you know, to get my camera replaced and I've gotta wait two weeks. So that's why I'm doing this on my phone. But while I was there, this is for my dad. He never watches my YouTube channel, so it's fine. This is a head mount for a GoPro for him to take on his hunts because he's a habit hunter as we've mentioned before we eat venison we hunt it we eat it and we own land so he loves hunting then I got this Kate Spade iPhone case this is for my iPhone XS Max is that what it is? yes it's the big one so it's really Christmassy it's all sparkly I don't know if you can yeah yeah look how brilliant it's so pretty I just thought it looked Christmassy and then it's not a pop socket, it's the ring. But it looks like this. It's just it works the same way as a pop socket. You just stick your finger through it. I don't know what these are called. If you know what they're called, put it in the description. But I just thought that was really Christmassy. Victoria's Secret. Ow! Ow! <laughs> oh. oh my god! Victoria's Secret. As you can see, this is a pretty big bag. That really hurt. Ow. Normal people would take that out of the vlog, but I'm gonna leave it in. So when you buy a certain amount of stuff at Victoria's Secret, sometimes they give you stuff free. Since the Victoria's Secret fashion show was last night, I think, uh, they were giving away the Victoria's Secret fashion show bag. Actually pretty cute. Usually I hate their bags and think they're super tacky, but. This one's not massive and huge. Used to, they would be like so big. It's like, what do you think I'm gonna do with this? It says Victoria's Secret, NYC 2018 because the fashion show was in New York City. I also got a new perfume. It's called Victoria's Secret Bombshell Nights. And it's very festive as well. I just hope this was pretty and it smells amazing, but it's gonna look really gorgeous sitting on my nightstand. 
This still hurts. <laughs> so pretty. Look. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay, I'm putting that on. Oh man, how do I explain it? It's a little grapefruity, but not super grapefruity. Next up, where's the garbage? Pajamas, you gotta have Christmas pajamas. And since we're not gonna be home, I definitely wanted to have some cute ones to take with us. These are plaid pants and a black slouchy shirt. You will be seeing these on my Instagram very soon. Anyways, very cute Christmas pajamas, pajamas. Pajamas, PJs. This little chick right here is supposed to be a model of what they actually look like. I don't know. Whatever, they're cute, they're plaid, I got them. I needed some good workout leggings. Okay, I didn't need them. But I got them anyways because I got those new Adidas shoes and I really wanted some Victoria's Secret leggings to go with them. Specifically these because they're see-through. And they have this like ballet kind of tie up thing. I just thought these were really kind of sexy for leggings. I've seen that several people have these and I just thought that they were, I got this zip up hoodie to go with my leggings. It's just this gray Victoria's Secret hoodie, very oversized. It says Victor Victoria Sport on the arm. I just wanted something plain and cozy comfy for plane rides because I'm gonna be on a plane a lot in the next few months. Okay, thank you, next. This is from Earthbound. It's just a little wooden incense box. I keep lots and lots of incense. If you've watched our Facebook lives, people think our house is on fire because they'll have it burning and it's like behind us and it looks like, well, it is smoke. Smoke's coming up behind us and people are like, your house is on fire. No, it's just patchouli. So anyways, this is just to go instead of, ha I have like the cardboard boxes always sitting out and those aren't cute. I don't know why it's taking me so long to get one of these because I've been burning incense since I was like nine. Thank you, next. Okay, there's some stuff in here that you can't see yet because it's a secret. Okay, moving on. Bath and Body Works. Now, I swear to you, if anybody leaves me a comment that's all like, those are full of chemicals, mama, blah, blah, whatever. It's my life. How cute is this? It's a little lantern. It's a wallflower. You put the wallflower in here, you plug it in, it lights up. I love it. This is one of my favorite smells from Bath & Body Works. It's called Rosewater and Ivy. These are on sale for $5.95. Okay, so I got Fireside, which is one of my all-time favorite smells. It smells like a fire. Candy cane, winter rose, mahogany balsam. Balsam? Pro hmm. I'm probably pronouncing that wrong. Michael Kors. This jacket, full price, $200. And I paid $80. Oh my gosh, look at this. I've been wanting a puff, puff jacket for a while, but I didn't find one that I really liked. Plus they're kind of expensive. So I found this. God, it's got a hood. I'll probably end up taking the hood off, but I don't know if you, let's see here. So this is what it looks like on. And it's got like gold hardware. It's got the MK on the shoulder. It's just, it's really nice. Next. Tell me those aren't like super glam, right? Oh my gosh. I don't know. What do you think? Anyways, gold. Apparently I'm feeling the gold this year. Cause I got gold earrings on too. Okay. They come in this lovely Michael Kors carrying case so that you don't smush them. Christmas socks. How cute. Oh my gosh. How cute are these? These are also from H&M. These are $13 and it's one, two, three, four, five pair of socks. That's not bad. That's not bad. Okay. Well, let's check my mail. So this says from No Bed Mondays. 
I don't remember ordering anything from a place called No Bad Mondays, but that don't mean anything. Oh my God, it smells horrible. <laughs> I'll show you a picture when I get it put in there, but it's just, <laughs> looks like Beetlejuice stripes. It's black and white stripes. And you set your keyboard and your mouse. It's like a keyboard and a mouse pad thing, like all in one. Plus my um, desk is kind of like dirty because it's white. Because I like white. But I don't think it through about how, you know, it's not going to stay white for more than a day. So, anyway, it's not white anymore. So, I got that to cover it up and make it look cute. <gasps> Y'all, it's those AirPods. Remember the AirPods that I told you guys? So they finally came in the mail. It did take them a while, but I did get a tracking number on them and everything. Okay, so um, let me give you my first impression on this. It is bigger than the normal AirPods. The real ones, the Apple ones, these are not Apple. These are a knockoff. Anyways, they were cheap. Like seriously, less than $20, I know for sure. So they're bigger. They don't use an Apple charger. They use an Android charger. I don't know if they come with a charger. Let's see. They do indeed come with a charger. So that's good. Take it out. Wow, these are huge. Oh, wow. I don't know that these will fit in my ear. Oh, they're okay. Wow, they're so much bigger than the Apple one. Hey, right, is that it? That's all the things, I think. Okay. I'm going to end this vlog right here because I feel like that's enough for today. We've been together all day. So, I'm going to end it here, and I will see you guys in the morning. I shut my eyes, trying not to speak, pretend that I'm dreaming. I smell your breath, not listening, but I still hear you screaming.